I grew up in Thermal. In high school, I guess I just try to fit in with other people. The people I, I hung out with, it seemed like they didn't care about school, so I, I copied it, not really caring. It made me like actually start making me think that I didn't care when in reality I cared. I just didn't pay attention because I would mostly be trying to like still fit in with the people that I hung out with. It affected my grades. It made me start feeling like I didn't really like school anymore, so I started like ditching sometimes, not even going. It made life seem kind of depressing, so it's just like, like I had no motivation to really like do anything. And it just, yeah, it affected my, my graduation status. I got called into the counselor's office. She was telling me that I wasn't gonna graduate. I just sometimes realized how ignorant I was at the, the fact that they were actually trying to help keep me like on the right path. It made me feel like the past years I had wasted them doing nothing that I wanted to change. I knew about the YOC before I finally called. Well, I was nervous at first like coming in here, but they were all like really friendly, really helpful. For youth my age that haven't had like any work experience, they could help them get work experience. They could help you find your purpose or find what you really want to do in life. Seeing the progress of the things I'm able to do now, so I, that kind of motivated me to keep going. And then once I started seeing the changes, it just kept driving me towards the, keeping at my goal. And I plan on like getting a bachelor's degree so I could, once I'm out, I could like become an FBI agent. After finishing the workshops that I needed to do, they also asked me if I would be interested in uh, going to DC. And then we went to the Smithsonian. We spoke with Dr. Raul Rees, and then well, we went into the, the House of Representatives. Oh, we went to the Kennedy Center the Lincoln Memorial. It was pretty exciting, it was really cool. It doesn't feel real and then you realize that you're actually going to these places that you've always seen and you're seeing them in person. If you're like stuck, not knowing what to do, you're like unhappy with what you're doing, I would recommend coming so it could help you figure out what you wanna do or what the things you actually like doing. Yeah, I would recommend coming to the youth center.